I could say I'm the most bully person on on the world. Melania Trump sat down with Good Morning America for a rare interview during her first international solo trip as first lady. During the segment, which aired in part Wednesday, the former model who married President Donald Trump in 2005 spoke to ABC News' Tom Yamas on location in Africa and shared her thoughts about issues that have had an impact on her husband's administration, including the Me Too movement. I support the women and they need to be heard. However, Melania added that she believes the public needs to show the same amount of respect to men. We need to support them and you know also men not just women these comments come just days after brett kavanaugh was confirmed to the u.s supreme court following a headline making testimony against dr christine blasey ford who along with two other women publicly accused kavanaugh of sexual assault donald trump said that the kavanaugh hearing marked a very scary time for young men in america and melania seems to agree she told abc that women need to provide sufficient evidence if they want their stories of sexual assault to be believed I do stand with women, but we need to show the evidence. You cannot just say to somebody, I was sexually assaulted or you did that to me because sometimes the media goes too far and the way they portray some stories, it's not correct, it's not right, she said. During her chat on GMA, Melania also opened up about the motivation behind her campaign against cyberbullying. In a new clip from the second part of her sit down, which aired Thursday morning, Melania insisted that she is the most bullied person in the world. You think you're the most bullied person in the world? One, one of them, if you really see what people are saying about me. The First Lady said that the intense scrutiny she faces online inspired her campaign. My Be Best initiative is focusing on social media and online behavior. We need to educate the children of social, emotional behavior so when they grow up, they know how to deal with those issues, she said. The former model, however, has been widely mocked for her initiative since her husband, President Trump, frequently takes to Twitter to attack people for their looks, intelligence, and talent. Elsewhere in the interview, Trump also opened up about the possibility of living in the White House for another six years if her husband were to run for a second term. I believe that my husband is doing an incredible job for this nation and I want the American people to have success. So whatever he will decide, I will support him, she said. I'm enjoying it. I really love to live in the Washington and in the White House. And yes, I'm enjoying it. To read more on Melania Trump, sit down with Good Morning America. Head to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Neha Joy.